blatant signs that your girl is cheating on you. Let's dive into this, shall we? All right, so the very first sign that women give that they are cheating on you, right? Very, very blatant sign that many guys miss is that she will start changing up her routine, okay? What do I mean by that? Um, what a lot of these women will do when she starts cheating on you is um, she'll start watching out more than normal um, in regards to what she eats, her diet. She will start eating a lot healthier all of a sudden where she used to eat nachos and you know pizza with you like five days a week all of a sudden no she just wants a salad and one crouton you know and she starts changing her uh, her, her eating habits she'll start working out more okay uh, she she will also start dressing differently along with this okay so you notice just her habits are changing right out of nowhere she never did this before before you've been you've been together for a few years now this is the first time she's done anything like this. Out of the blue. She just wants to be healthier, look better, look hotter. She might start going to hair salon all of a sudden. Never did that before. Might start doing her nails. Never did that before or change the color of her nails, right? Never put, she always used to have clear nails. Now she's putting color on them, right? Just little things like that, right? Little touches, clothes, hair, makeup. Might start doing that stuff differently as well. Besides her eating habits and also the fact that she suddenly got a gym membership. She's going to the gym, going to Pilates four or five days a week. Why are you trying to get fit all of a sudden? Why are you trying to drop all this weight? Right? Number one sign. Um, number two sign, right? The second sign that she's cheating on you and getting away with it is uh, she begins hiding her phone. Whereas before... She would put her phone right at the top center of her car. You would watch videos together as you drive along. Uh, now she is no longer doing that, okay? Now she is hiding her phone from you. And uh, she's telling you, why don't you put your phone up there for a change? I always put my phone up there. I don't want to put my phone up there anymore. You use your phone. You use your data. She starts coming up with certain excuses to, to make you believe, oh, okay, she just doesn't want to uh, use up all her data and uh, time for me to start putting my phone on there. You're like, okay, I'll ignore this. So suddenly you also notice that uh, when she is going to uh, the bathroom, like say you're at a restaurant, unlike, you know, unlike the old days, she used to leave her phone on the table. Now she takes her phone with her. And now instead of her being in the bathroom for, you know, like a few minutes, now she's in there for like 15 minutes. Like, what are you doing in there? You taking a dump or something? And you're with your phone. Who are you texting in there? Whatever. You know, and um, she starts hiding it from you. She might also start hiding her social media from you, right? Where before, like, she would just have her social media open, right? And now it's privatized, right? Where you can't see it unless you add her, you know? And uh, Or she might be keeping certain posts from you, right? But she starts to hide her social media from you. You know, she's, she starts to text like this if she's using her phone. And anytime you try to ask her about this, or if she gets a call, another thing I want to point out, if she gets a call and then she declines it while she's with you, like why are you declining the, why are you declining these calls all of a sudden, you know? And then when you ask her about it, uh, she gets upset and she's like, "Why are you questioning me? Why do you want to know?" Well, you know, and she starts uh, reacting, you know, reacting to you, uh, getting triggered by the fact that you're questioning her, right? Which is really a uh, deflection mechanism. Um, that is another sign, okay? And the third and final sign that she is blatantly cheating on you is she begins reconnecting with old friends, old girlfriends that she used to go clubbing with, hang out with, people that you have not seen in years since you started dating that disappeared long ago are all of a sudden back in her life and they are all of a sudden going out again together as a group which she stopped doing once you guys became a couple because she wanted to be respectful that you're a couple. But now, she's suddenly reconnected with these people. Might even be some family members, right? And they are going out together. They might start going, you know, bar hopping or clubbing together, big red flag. You gotta have your boundaries with that, guys. Don't let your girls go clubbing on you. Um, I mean, you know what's happening at these clubs. So uh, it's bad enough if she's on social media. She's getting DM'd by other guys. But at the club, these guys are, you know, DMing her in person, right? I mean, they're walking up to her in person. So 
Uh, but she starts hanging out with these people, might even go on a trip with them without you, and suddenly just starts, you know, becoming, um, trading plans that you have with her to go out with her girlfriends instead, right? However, all of these three, three things tied together should tell you that something is up, right? All these things happening all of a sudden out of the ordinary should tell you that something is not right in your relationship and your chick is probably cheating on you. Now, if she starts dieting or something and starts eating healthy, does that automatically mean she's like running over, running around behind your back? No, of course not, right? She could just want to change her, her lifestyle, be better. And in many cases, she might want to include you with it. Like, hey, can we eat better together, right? But if she just wants to do this alone, hmm, you have to ask, you have to wonder, right? But, uh, but a good woman would be like, let's do it together. Let's hold each other accountable, right? And let's get healthier together. So you're gonna have to understand like where her where her head is. Um, however, her changing her habits and routines all of a sudden, I mean, she she could even change the music she's listening to. Whereas, like, say she never listened to rap music before, all of a sudden she's listening to all this rap music, and you're like, where's this coming from? You never liked rap, right? Or say she never ate in a Greek restaurant before, all of a sudden she wants to eat try Greek food, right? These are things that should raise eyebrows in your relationship, right? Because they're out of the ordinary. They're they're beyond the status quo, okay? Because whenever a woman starts doing things out of the ordinary, I mean, man or woman in a relationship, that's how you know something is up. Something's going on here. Something is fishy. And then on top of that, she's hiding her phone. She's declining calls. She no longer wants you to anywhere near her phone. She's password protecting all of her social media and everything else, all of her electronic devices huge red flag, right? That should really, really definitely raise suspicion. And then thirdly, reconnecting with these old friends that she suddenly starts going out with. Um, all these things tied together, I hate to say it unfortunately, nine out of 10 times the chick is cheating, right? If it's just one thing or the other, you know, that, that I wouldn't fly off the handle with that and I wouldn't like just suddenly accuse her of going around behind your back if it's just one thing or the other, but if it's all three of these things tied together, then definitely something is amiss, right? And something, something is just not right, man. You've got trouble in paradise, right? And you might want to catch it before it goes any further. Because many times, and unfortunately, I hate to tell you this, but many times when a woman has already gone, gone this far and has done these three things, there's usually no stopping her. She's usually gonna go the distance, right? And she is going to uh, end up cheating on you if she is not cheating on you already, right? Uh, many times a woman will do these things and, and really hasn't cheated on you yet. However, she may have already met the guy already, right? Your replacement, the guy that she is going to monkey branch to. Many times in these situations, she's already met that guy. And if she hasn't yet, she is setting herself up to meet that guy. She's basically setting herself up to leave you because when a woman leaves a man, um, she will do it months prior to actually pulling the trigger, right? She will, she will do it months prior. She will build her support system. She will prepare herself mentally. She will get all of her faculties in place. So by the time that she tells you it's over and she wants to end things, you're kind of blindsided, right? You, you're just, I mean, like most guys, it's its like crashing into a wall at 100 miles per hour, right? It's like a ton of bricks. It's like, whoa, where did this come from? I didn't even see this coming from, right? Because many times we're not paying attention in these relationships. We tend to think everything's fine when, when it's not. <laughs> we tend to think everything's okay, but it's not. And so uh, we miss these signs, right? But that's why I'm, I'm waking you guys up, man. I'm nudging you, on, nudging you on the shoulder if your girl is starting to do these things, right? It's, it's a wake-up call that, hey, she might be preparing herself to leave you, right? And in many cases, when a woman goes this far, like I said, she will leave. Uh, it's just a matter of time. You're, uh, I mean, your days are pretty much numbered at this point. So just an FYI, I hope this helps you guys. I, <laughs> you know, I hope it doesn't scare you guys, but uh, I just want to give you guys some 
some positive, uh, or I mean, some heads, it's not very, you know, it's not that positive, but I want to give you guys a heads up in case you're going through this now. Um, and uh, so, you know, you can take coercive action and do whatever you need to do to prepare yourself as well because she's not going to tell you she's not going to help you these chicks just they don't care they're not going to be like hey you better prepare too because i'm leaving you so i'm getting prepared so you better prepare no they're just going to leave you high and dry and you're going to be left holding the bag you're going to be crying your eyes out oh why did she leave me why 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 well, meanwhile she's going to be running off with her new boyfriend and this is why a lot of you guys are always shell-shocked you know like a week or two after your breakup, she's already with the other dude. Like, where did this guy come from? Well, the truth is she met him months ago, right? It, it, she was just setting herself up to leave you finally. Maybe she didn't cheat on, she didn't cheat yet. Maybe she didn't do anything with the guy yet, but now that it's officially over, she's gonna do something with him, right? If she hasn't already. But uh, if she, you know, for whatever reason, if she remained faithful during your relationship now, she's got the full go ahead, the full green light to, uh, you know, to jump into a relationship with this new dude and leave you holding the bag. Sad, sad. But as always, gentlemen, drop your comments below. Let me know what you think of tonight's coaching video. Anything you'd like to add, anything you'd like to share, please drop them in the comments below and I will see you there in my comments. Until next time, this is Matt Cross from Alpha Male Secrets signing out here with my Lamborghini. Just got this car, very excited about it. We're gonna be featuring it a lot more here on the channel in the next coming months, the next coming years. Gonna be keeping this for a little while. I still have my DeLorean, by the way. So not selling the DeLorean, but uh, gonna be enjoying this car for a little while here. And if you wanna see the process of me purchasing this car, just go to my Instagram, my IG, at Matt Cross Official. Follow me on there. Uh, been posting a lot of videos about this car. Been working, I was working on this deal for over two months finally got it closed i was looking on for, i was on a hunt for this car looking for this car for over two years trying to find one in rasa festo red which is the color of this vehicle rasa festo red is probably hands down one of the rarest colors for the lamborghini it's also a fourteen thousand eight hundred eighty dollar option so it's uh it's a pretty rare find it's a fully loaded uh, vehicle But I'm going to do a full review on the car uh, here on my channel pretty soon, if it's not up already. So, yeah, follow me at Matt Cross Official. The same guy who delivered my DeLorean also delivered the Lamborghini. His name is TJ at Florida Exotic Transport. If you happen to purchase a muscle car, collector car, exotic car, he's your man for delivery. Funny enough, I bought this car um, also sight unseen like I did my DeLorean. Just when you get these deals, you just have to jump on it, right? You just have to jump on it, man. But as always, gentlemen, don't forget to smash that like button, smash the subscribe button, and smash that notification bell as well so you're notified whenever I release a brand new coaching video here on the YouTube. More importantly, guys, please make sure you subscribe to the channel. Helps me out a ton when you guys actually subscribe to the channel and you just don't take off on me. So subscribe to the channel, helps me out with the YouTube algorithm. And for you guys who want to support my work and all of this insane red pill, gold pill, platinum pill content that I'm teaching you here on my channel, the best way to do that is becoming a, basically a subscriber of my premium Alpha Male Secrets channel. Right now, it's only a buck for the entire first month of premium Alpha Male Secrets content from me. So take advantage of it. All you need to do is click the link below in my description box. It will take you over to my website where you can get signed up right now. Just say two seconds. So do that now, and I'll see you in my next coaching video. I'm out.